This is Dana Wick Quad Legs and we're installing the props. We're using with the box quad eight, four, five props. And of course, bright yellow. We have a few different, you know, colors of course, but today we're using these. Eight inches, tip to tip. 4-5 is the pitch. We're going to install the bushings and we're going to size them up. And we'll pick one that seems to fit the best. And there we are. If you try the others, that one won't go on. This one's real loose. This one fits really well. So let's go ahead and take these off. So if you remember in the build, everything was revolving around the uh, motors, uh, the position of the motors, and the um, rotation direction of the motors and that's going to hold true with picking the proper prop to put on these props are directional they're clockwise and counterclockwise and with the kit you're getting two clockwise and two counterclockwise so if you notice on the props you look at the writing and it says eight by four five l left eight by four point five R. So R clockwise, L counterclockwise. It stands for right and left. But anyway, R will be clockwise, L will be counterclockwise. And you can also tell how it's cut as to the direction it should be going to push the air down. Okay? We're going to put your bushing in and they fit in like so okay we'll have a video coming out later on on balancing the props it's always good to balance the props um, the props normally come and they'll have some imperfections to it and by balancing the props and we normally just put a piece of tape on on one end uh, to achieve that and you'll balance the props and they'll fly better. They'll fly good like this, but if you're filming, um, you'll get a little bit of vibration if the props aren't balanced properly. We'll go through that later, okay? So if you remember, this is motor number one and this turns clockwise. So, We'll get our prop, and it's, it's hard for you to see here, but when you have it in your hand, you'll see R, okay? And that would be clockwise. This is motor number two, and it will go counterclockwise. And this says L. Motor number three will be clockwise. Motor number four will be counterclockwise. And now you have them on. You want to push them all the way down. And then apply your washer and the nut. When you tighten them down, you'll want to use a pair of pliers or, you know, like a crescent wrench. Um, and you would want to tighten them up and hold the motor and the prop and put a good bit of pressure on there. Okay, I would check this every flight, 
at least every other flight, but it's really easy. When you change the battery, you're going to go flying again. Just double check. It just takes a second to check the prop before you plug in the battery. Again, we want to remember that the props really don't need to go on until you're ready to fly. And anytime you're working on your quad, make sure and take the props off. If you're indoors and you are plugging in your quad, I would also make sure that the props are off. Just safety. You really don't need the props until you're ready to fly. Okay. After tightening these up, you're ready to go. Clockwise, R. Counterclockwise, L. Clockwise, R. Counterclockwise, L. Motor one, two, three, four. We're going to double check this when we go to flight for the first time. See you next time.